Is that the Hilo? Is he right there? Yes, it is the Hilo, I think. Alrighty, but we are good. Let's slow down the three knots or so. Neutral ballast. Ah, he's too far away for me to hear. It looks like he's close because I'm on the 40,000 yard scale. Where are those ships? Where are they? The Hilo is still like in front of the ships. And I, oh, there's one. There's a ship. Still far as balls away. There was another ship that was closer. Am I going to have to like juice it around and catch up to these dudes? And what is that going on back there by my rudder? You see that? There's like splish splash shit going on or something. Hmm. There's another ship. Zero knots. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's actually. I'm going to increase. Well, we are going eight knots, but I'm going to increase turns for five knots. A Jiang. Can't say I remember a Jiang from Dangerous Waters, but I'm sure it's in there. And the Luhu. Heading away from me. Still got lots of transients out there, but we're still really far from these dudes, so I'm going to have to like, pick someone to go after. Let's actually head for the Luhu. Uh, let's go down. I'm going to have to do some more running underneath the layer to get to this guy. It's kind of like sketchy tactics here. I obviously want to be like in a position to just be in front of them without having to maneuver around, but I don't really have a choice in the matter here. So as soon as I get beneath this layer, I'm going to juice up to full, catch up to this dude. Probably run for two minutes or something. I don't know how long we're going to run for. The yards in this game don't seem to actually decrease how they should, so I don't know how to judge it. That terrain looks crazy, yo. Um, I don't know. I guess I'm going to run at this speed for three minutes, maybe. Yeah, I'd say three minutes. And then uh, we'll pop up and see where this Luhu is. Luhu the hair. Can't snap right now. Alright, I'll see you guys shortly. Alrighty, we are back coming out of full running. I just found out I got 100% on my first midterm, so yay. But don't get too excited. That class is hella easy. <laughs> if I got anything less, I would have been ashamed of myself. But... Alright, bleeding off some speed and we're coming shallow. Should be right up this Luhu's ass. <laughs> Just my luck, we're gonna be like 2,000 yards behind it. Uh, that was sarcastic if you couldn't pick up on it. I tend to be very sarcastic and very not blunt about it. Alrighty, we're up here. Make turns for five knots. And uh, let's reacquire this Luhu already. Should be right in front of us. I'm hoping within torpedo range. <laughs> One can hope. One can hope indeed. Hey, there's something. I think that's the Jiang. But we still have all those transients off in the distance, whatever the hell they are. Tanker, tanker, merchant, merchant. Wow, they're really close together. <laughs> really close together. A lot closer together than I put ships. Okay, so I think we have two escorts and then all this merchant shipping. I was on one at the top that just showed up. Another merchant. This is crazy, yo. This is nothing but merchants, and they're all so freaking close. And they're, like, not moving. <laughs> Where's the Jiang? Where's that Jiang dude? There was a Jiang here. There's a Jiang among us. I 
up, so I should hang. I should head for these guys. Man, there's gonna be so much torpedo launching going on up in here. Up in here. All right, I'll hit one third. I'm gonna feel a little balls to the wall here. But you can see the transient for where the jinx should be, or the luhu, the luhu rather. It hasn't showed up yet. Oh. Oh no, that's the jing. I was gonna say. Should be closer to that Luhu. Wherever the hell it is. But yeah, we're, these guys are pretty far north up here. More further north than I thought they'd be. There he is. And we're still not really that close to him. Well, alright. Oh, I can just kind of see his surface crap going on his bubbles. Well, let's head for this guy. We gotta take him out anyway. Do we have to take him out? Prosecute all supply vessels. Eh, let's just go for the merchants first. If we have to take these guys out, then I'll take them out, but I just wanna get these merchants over with first. Man, could they make this any more easier? They're just like all sitting ducks. I hope I don't need more than one torpedo per ship, otherwise it's gonna take a long time to do. <laughs> Three complete salvos. All right. Well, the first one's coming up. Not really that soon. Uh. Hmm. All right. Well, um, I guess I'll just meet you guys there in firing range of these merchants. So I will see you then, because I don't think these surface ships can shoot torpedoes. I think they just have their little depth bomb crap. So. Yeah, see you in a few minutes. Alrighty, guys, we're coming within firing range of the group. We'll be there momentarily. I'm gonna swing to starboard and get a torpedo off at this Jang real quick before I start engaging the whole frickin' merchant cluster. You can see all these guys up here. They're all turning along in one knot, which just makes this easier for me, I suppose. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Like, that's ridiculous. One knot in hostile territory. Like, give me a break. Dude to be flanking it. Alright, we're almost in range of this Jang from me to get off a shot. I don't know why he's just not even moving. He's just chilling there. I guess he's supposed to be looking for me. But I'm also looking for him. And I found him. And I will sink him. Haha. -ha. There's also that... Well, I lose in my baffles now. We have to we have to go after him, but I don't know. I'm just shooting this guy because I don't want him to have to come after me when I start shooting the Murchies. But almost in range. Very shortly we'll be in range, and this gap is closing very slowly. But I don't dare increase my speed that much, if at all. I'm trying to be sneaky here. I'm trying to be super sneaky. Mmm, mm, candy. <laughs> it's like Otis from Op 4. Alrighty, let's uh, launch on. Let's start firing, shall we? I'm examining my all-natural peanut butter I purchased. I'm letting it sit upside down so the oil mixes in with the rest of the peanuts. Peanut butter. Fire! Alright, let's come back this way. Get a little closer to these dudes and we'll start firing on them as well. They look pretty damn big. I see the red of their keels really easily. Seeing an oil tanker, it's just gonna be a huge oil spill everywhere, dude. Which kind of blows. Alright, I think that is. I just wanna make sure. I don't wanna make positively sure I'm in range of these dudes, like sufficient range. So I'm gonna wait till 12,000 and then start lighting them up. And then as I get closer, I suppose I could use fasts. Fire! Man, this one all still like so far away. Oi! Oi! Absent. Oi, oi, oi. Torpedo tip one. Red, manned and ready in all respects. Uh, that Jane's probably gonna need more than one torpedo to take it out, but I'll wait till the first one has to see if I need to send another one his way. 
All right, I'm gonna launch at 13,000 yards and see if that's sufficient. Or if the torpedo will run out of fuel. New sonar contact, 30,000 yards. Oh, there's the, uh, Luhu. I guess he came out of my baffles, finally. All right, who else we got? Who else wants to heat it? Did I even hit this other dude over here? I wasn't even paying attention, man. I think I did. But I need to launch another one because he's not dead. I need more attention to my torpedoes. The Luhu is going down. What? Why? I didn't sink it. I am so confused. <laughs> New center contact. Is he. Holy crap, there's a ship right there. Where the hell did he come from? Dude, where did that guy come from? There's a ship right frickin' there, man. Where did he come from? Okay, that torpedo did hit, so I need more. More, more, more! Fire! I don't know what this is. Where did that thing come from? That seven ounce, I should've heard that dude. It's gonna take forever to sink all these ships, man. Contact type servers don't know really a thing. Alright, we'll hurry up and classify him so I can launch on him. He's heading away. Okay, is this 13,000 yard torpedo gonna hit? Well, we're about to find out. Can I zoom in one more? Yes, I can. Damn, it didn't hit too far. That sucks. Alright, launch two stealth. Hey, we got the Jang. We got that other tanker. So two torps on that dude. Uh, change this bad boy back to stealth. Who is this guy down here? Another Luhu. Well, fire. And fire. Holy crappioli, look at that. Shit's gruesome, man. Oh, and there's that tanker going down, too. Christ. That thing is really red if I ever saw a red ship. <laughs> Just like solid red, no shading or anything. Alright, well, actually, go back to 130. Yeah, there you go. Oh, I didn't actually know when you, like, increased. Oh, 130 is 9 knots, excuse me. 9 knots. I'm surprised these dudes aren't juicing it up, man. I'd be shitting a brick. Those torps might not make it to that Luhu down there. I want to know how that other Luhu sunk, though. That's kind of ridiculous. It just said it sunk. Like, I didn't do anything. <laughs> okay, that Luhu is actually turning. Turning westerly, so it's making the distance not expand as much. So maybe those torps will hit. Alright, should be hitting this other guy coming up. Oh, that one only needed one torpedo. Maybe the other torpedoes are just... Holy crap, and now it's not even there anymore. Jesus. <laughs> okay, I won't be doing that. Well, all these guys are in range, so I'm just going to launch a full spread on them. Starting with... Um, head this way. Oh, I lost that guy in my baffles. Hopefully the torps will hit. Are they gonna hit? Maybe. Was that a hit? Didn't say ran out of fuel, so I think that was a hit. Hey, there you go. Alright, these guys have actually increased speed a little bit. I'm gonna increase speed as well. I will raise you an increase in speed, good sir. Well, I can launch on these guys. Man, that ship just frickin' imploded. Recommend we proceed to the waypoint location. Well, no shit, I gotta take these guys out first. Dog. Just head straight for these dudes. Uh, the one torpedo should be sufficient. I hope. What is on the left of my screen there? There's like stuff coming up and down. 
don't know. It's weird, man. It's weird, man. You're crazy. All right, uh, don't go so fast that I can't launch any torps. All right. Fire one. Fire two. Shattered into two. Bullshit, Snapple. Let's stop them. So I can <laughs> get down the speed and actually launch a torp. That's more like it. Not so bad. Already now we're just waiting for the clock to run and these guys to hit. Hope one's enough, but if not, we'll be ready. Uh, focus your efforts on the torpedo room. Thank you, Chief Engineer. Alright, we should be getting a hit over here few seconds. Wow. He's disintegrated too. That was pretty loud. <laughs> Should be getting a hit here in a second or two. Damn. No, it's not sinking. It was vaporized. You're crazy, man. This is crazy. We're killing so many people. That helicopter is probably still just sitting back there with its thumb his butt, like, huh? What's going on? Like, he should be bearing down on my ass, launching torps or sono buoys or something. Harassing the shit out of me. Let's go to periscope depth. Ah, there's no point. They're gonna hit before I even get up there. 3, 2, 1. They're probably gonna hit, like, almost the same time. Boom. Boom. Wow. Alright, down we go. Let's head back for the waypoint. Already. Tube is fixed very well. Only have nine torps left. Hope we don't run into anything else. But down we go. So I can run to this waypoint. <laughs> Alright, guys. If something comes up, I will let you know. Otherwise, I'll meet you at Delta. See you in a bit. Hey, we're back. Rendezvous with the USS McKee. Uh, let's go up. We're beneath the layer. Message awaiting for us topside. Very well. Up we go. Yeah, in the last mission I was just flanking it around, dicking around. Going up and down really quickly. <laughs> if they used like, the speed model of this in Dangerous Waters, I think that would make Dangerous Waters even better. Like takes forever to get the top speed in this game, which I think is pretty realistic. And then slowing down, give me a break, that takes even longer. Which I think is pretty realistic too. But in Dangerous Waters, it's like... Like, on the parry, it's like, what? Within a minute, you're already at top speed? Like, if that short, or if that long? And then a sub, as soon as you, like, come down from flank, like, you come down to, like, five knots, like, in 30 seconds. <laughs> if even that long. Like, it's insane. It's crazy, yo. All right, level the planes. I think that should be good to carry us to to come stepped. But maybe not. Keep a little bit up on the planes, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, now you can level. Sonar contact. That's probably the McKee. Comms. Sync pack fleet to Cheyenne. Congratulations on destroying the supply fleet. Rendezvous with the USS McKee and rearm. Very well. New sonar contact. I think that's another ship. Well, I don't think it's a. S well, we're at periscope depth, so slow down. Uh, how do you go reverse again? <laughs> oh, R. All back full. Slow down so I can raise the scope. I just want to see what's going on up there. Oh, I'm not in a periscope depth. Oh, I missed. Do no. Pretty much at the waypoint anyway. This mission's over. Hey, there you go. Yeah, we're friendlies. Friendlies up around here, so I will surface. That's the McKee right there. LY Spear, Ticonderoga, Forestall. 
That's a four. That is a four stall. Thanks for watching, everyone. It's been FPS Chasley. This was uh, whatever this mission's called. I don't remember. Uh, yeah. So next time, I'll see you then. Figure out what else will, uh, the sync pack fleet will have us do in this conflict. So until then, thanks for watching, and as always, good hunting.